Wizard of West LA here. I have discovered something I wanted to make a quick video about it regarding Ethernet and the iPhone. Remember in the other video we had this connector and we hooked it up to get Ethernet? Well, now we're running into a problem. And I'll tell you what it does. This is after an, an update to iOS 15. I'm researching the problem when I figure it out. I'll let you guys know. This, these products are actually very popular on the internet. This is not just some one-off that I thought. There is a whole, a whole website with various products that they use in a lot of situations where you can use your phone, but they don't want you doing anything on Wi-Fi. They want it all with Ethernet. Androids and iPhones can both go on the internet using Ethernet. So I'm going to plug it in and I'm going to it'll show up as Ethernet now it's not showing anything right now I'm going to plug in the cable and let's see what this does now as I plug in the cable unfortunately this device doesn't have a any uh, lights on it or anything so let me try to go back into it go to Ethernet Okay, the problem I'm seeing, it doesn't show an IP address. I've actually even tried. Actually, what I might do is I'm going to take off. I took off Wi-Fi and cellular, and it's still not doing anything. So this is an issue I'm going to, I'm going to figure out. Uh, I've actually used uh, a manual... I'll just do it on here. This is a, a a manual address I know that works. I've done it on other devices. So now I've actually put a an address on here. In the past, even if I did this, that should actually work. I'm actually going to configure the DNS server as I know, I just checked another machine, and that's the DNS uh, server, what's on here. If I go to that, I'm going to go to, see, I'm going to go to Google. I'll just try Google. It doesn't work. So, I just wanted to leave this video out and let you guys know that there is a problem. And I am going to check this out and find out how to fix this problem. I'm going to actually set this back on automatic. I've tried various different various different setups, including even using uh, V6. I've tried that also, and I was amazed that that didn't work. So I just wanted to let you know there is a problem. If you do find a solution, put your comment on the bottom. Uh, I don't know if you can put a link, but you can give me a description what to search for. I'll find the website because there are a lot of products that use this ethernet connection and I know this needs to be repaired and I'm hoping it's repaired really soon so anyway just wanted to leave you the message so remember keep on learning